Tech Radio Check. Yo, 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 what's good? It's your brother Breezy Brainstorm. And this is the Hip Hop Riff of the Week, episode 126, Brainstorm Productions. This week, we gonna be all right. Kendrick Lamar. I feel like this song was very fitting for the times we're going in right now with these riots and protests going on across the nation. Rest in peace, George Floyd. Injustice gots to stop. And there's plenty of songs talking about it, how we feel about it. This jump popped up in the queue, so you already know what to do. This week, it is in G. It's a progression from G sharp to G. As bass players, we're going to be playing the root fifth octave. This is a root fifth octave type bass line, and we are really following the pocket of the kick in this song. Pretty much every rhythm you play as the bass player will be the kick rhythm as well. So that's going to be the thing you want to focus on the most in this lesson is when I'm playing because we already know what I'm playing. We're playing G sharp, G, and D. So I'm going to play all the way through in case I may over speak and complicate things. I'm gonna let you see it once and then I'm gonna explain it. So remember the only notes are G sharp, G and D. First note is G sharp and keep the rhythm. So we'll do it a little bit slow. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That's essentially the riff. So let's talk about it. <laughs> G sharp to G. Then it goes to D flat. Back down to the G. When it goes back down to the G, before we go to the next bar, you can hear it starts to lead off as if it wants to go up an octave. That's when this part comes in. Then slide to G sharp. Root fifth octave descending. Then we stay on this rhythm. Mm. This is the lead in back to the one. One, two, three, four. So um, now let's talk about rhythm. That is what's pretty much important. As you can see, I only played three notes. Two of them were octaves. So now we could talk about the rhythm. So G sharp. Before we go to the G, we hit a ghost note because that's where the kick hits. So. Every ghost note you play in this riff is where a kick hits in the song. So that's very important. It's part of the feel. Whoa, hold on, one more time. Starting from the top. And I'm gonna play it again slowly. This will be better. I play it again slowly, but this time watch for when I use ghost notes. Ghost notes, if you don't know, are like stuff like this. Like my fingers resting on it but it's not ringing it out, it's leaving a ghost note. But ghost notes are usually used for rhythmic variation when playing bass lines. All right, hold on, one more time. See, when we get to the the climax, there's a ghost note before we slide back to G, just like how we did in the beginning, an octave below. Then we go do our um, root fifth octave descending. And now we're near the tail end of the riff. So once we, we 
just we just rock here on rhythmic wise we just rock here and the last change we do before we go back home is this so just remember you're not really doing much you're actually riding on a lot of the same notes rhythmically the one thing that tripped me up was once we that part always felt like I needed to go someplace else. I like I'm on the note too long. Nah, just ride that rhythm. The last thing you need to do is. have it one more thing i will talk about fingerings index finger well middle finger on the g sharp i'm just keeping it in one um four fret span so middle finger on g sharp index finger on g um sometimes i use my pinky finger but for this riff i'm using my ring finger to do my root fifth octave and i'm using my pinky for the g sharp octave ring finger for um coming back down then same thing for the root hooked octave rocking those fingering wise that's all i'm doing we're staying in the same same range and we get in the groove so real simple the hardest part is actually catching the rhythm of when to play the bass line so that's going to take some listening maybe some slowing it down hopefully um well, you can slow down this video <laughs> and you can see what I'm doing. Um, I'll play it, I guess, one more time, extra super slow so you can like, analyze stuff. Let me count y'all in. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. There we go. Y'all got it. It's your brother, Breezy Breezy. So we going to be all right. Enjoy yourselves. Stay woke. Stay strong. Stay healthy. And I'm going to catch you on the next one. Peace. Talking now. Talking now. Talking now. Talking now.